guys, what's up? It's I, Jevin. How is everybody doing? I am back with another episode of Feed the Beast on Hermitcraft server. Today, we're going to be working on a quarry and things like that. We were going to do it last episode, but I really focused on the power suit. Uh, I'm kind of sad, though, because I worked my butt off to craft this OV scanner, um, which is it's used to make the... Um, this guy high efficiency uh, solar generator and you can't get a piece of the rubber that I need um, it's like for the computer chip or something uh, we need to make that guy I can't craft it because it's not in the game <laughs> so I have to wait for hypno to come back from uh, his business trip to uh, get the computer chip so I can make that <laughs> pretty silly but it's all good um, I've been working on some things. I've got some iron plates here. Um, my game plan is to actually do... Um, I'm going to do like a 64 by 64 quarry. But I'm actually going to center my power source. Um, because we don't really have a stable power source. So I'm just going to use biofuel. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to run four quarries around this biofuel. That way we can get the most out of the area before we have to move everything. So hopefully this will work out pretty well for us. Um, the first thing that I want to craft though is some more of these things. Uh, we're definitely going to need some more valves and things like that. Um, I should probably check and see if I actually have any of this stuff because before I craft it, this stuff isn't really that easy. Or not e it's not easy to craft, but... It takes uh, a bit of iron, and that's one thing that I'm actually running. Hold on, it seems that's not what I'm looking for sound. Man, the sound seems really, really loud. Uh, I think we're gonna need the glass. So go ahead and take both of those. I don't, I don't think that I have any extra stuff. Oh, I lied. I have more right here. Okay, well we're doing good then. I'll take those iron bars too, because we're gonna need them. And that's why we always check. So th the main reason for this quarry is obviously so we can get to Emmy. I don't have enough quartz to do anything yet. Um, all of our quartz is over here, I think. Yeah, we have like two stacks. So we're not doing very good on quartz. So the first thing that I want to do is I want to make some more iron tank walls, not golden apples. Which So that's pretty easy. It should just be... Yeah, that's pretty easy. Uh, let's just throw a stack at it. There we go. So we've got a lot more of that. Um, then I want to make some more of these uh, tank gauges. Oh, come on. There we go. So I think that is... Okay, let's do that. Oh, it already crafted it for us. Or maybe not. I hate when it does that. It looks like it's up there and it's not really up there. Why you do this to me? There we go. Let's just do this. There we go. So we'll just craft as many of those as we can. So we got a little bit more of those now. And we're going to... Actually, I think the valves should be good. So what we're going to do now is we're going to head over to our quarry age. This is a quarry age that Hypno made. Uh, if I go... Hmm. I want to say it's this way. It's one of those directions. Uh, other people have quarries here, but I moved a little bit further away because obviously I want to be, I want to make sure that my quarry has enough room to run and things like that. Um, I'm hoping that I'm far enough away. At least I don't see anything on the mini map. Um, so this is where I decided to just a quarry, and this is where I'm going to put our tank at. That's going to hold all of our biofuel. So we have a couple different options for tank sizes. We can do five by five, seven by seven, um, or nine by nine. Also. You notice that I am flying, but you don't hear a jetpack. I was hanging out with D-Mac and Assassin, and D-Mac's like, come over to our base, come over to my base. So he's been doing advanced genetics, and uh, he actually gave me a syringe to let me fly. So right now I can fly like I'm in creative mode. So I took the, um, the thing off my jetpack, so I don't need it. Uh, you do fly pretty slow, but that doesn't exactly matter to me. Um... So we'll go here. I, I think I'm going to do a 9x9, nine nine, though. Um, we'll see how big this one is. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So that's the 7x7 seven seven tank. Actually, that's that's pretty big. Um, Let's do 7 high as well. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I should have brought the builder's wand with me. Uh, 
yeah that'll be fine but uh yeah so what we're gonna do is i've been working on getting as many dyes as i possibly can so i'm going to make uh like two more of these biofuel reactors and i'm gonna just start pumping as much biofuel into this as possible i'm also going to make a couple more of these biofuel generators because i want our quarry to run at full speed so um you know i like right like i said in in the future i would love to use quarries plus because it's such a better mod than the original quarry uh i just don't have the stuff to make it yet so these this first four quarries that we're going to run they'll be 64 by 64 but um after that we should be able to really step up our game some so i'm gonna go ahead and finish this and i'm gonna get everything set up to where we can start putting biofuel in right we're just about ready to get our tank going uh, i'm gonna collect some of this stuff really quickly i'm just gonna need this um i've crafted two more of the biofuel uh generators and two of the things that actually make the power hoping that those are enough the only thing left to do is to go down here um i still gotta run a bunch of trees i've actually got this thing set up to where it will run oh it scared the shit out of me breathe jevin oh i saw like a shadow and i thought somebody was behind me and i about dumped in my pants <laughs> <laughs> okay anyways i have this thing set up to where it it gets rid of all the ones we can't use so this is all stuff that we can put right into there and uh it'll just it'll go forever because it's so efficient so let's just go ahead and grab a bunch of that um i'm gonna be coming back and grabbing a lot more as well uh we want to try to get as many different types of uh items in there as possible that way it runs as efficient as possible i think it's like max of nine or something i forget though um i should have chests already there so we should be good to go on that um okay see how see see what i mean by like i can fly in creative but it's really really slow really really slow all right so let's see let's go ahead chests I'll just uh, put those back for a second. I want to kind of get these all set up first. I want to put this into where it makes it like... Um, how can I do this? I wanted it to be where they were all connected. Hmm. I don't think it's going to be possible, though. I would love to have more storage than that. But I guess we could just do it like this. And we can add double chest on later if we want. Just like that. Let me... I would say I'll fix that later. Um, okay, so... We want one of each color in there. You see, we need to get the efficiency way up. Let's just... Uh, can I not shift into there? Let's just start throwing colors in here. The more we add in, the more colors it, uh... Oh, so you can't put those up there? Okay. I probably need to go back and, uh... So is that putting that is putting in? Okay, so the game plan is to have three of these running pretty much full-time. Um... And as you can see, we're going to need a lot more bone meal or a lot more stuff because the efficiency on these isn't very high. But when do you get these things super efficient? Like, you see how this is like, it's literally taking none out of here. Like, um, the numbers are barely moving. So, well, that's the game plan is to get all of them moving that fast. So these, this thing just fills up incredibly quick. All right, guys, I am back. I've been uh, been working. It doesn't look like we have very much biofuel because I've been in and out of the dimension. I actually need to get some sort of chunk loader here. Uh, right now we're up to 16, 17,000 biofuel, which is 17 buckets. Uh, pretty awesome. Just continuously dumping in. So as you can see, I went through back through um, all of our biofuel reactors and made sure that they were all at the very top efficiency that we could possibly get. Uh, so we're all doing all doing very well here. And then each one of these chests uh, were filled up with dyes, and it's continuously filling in down through here. And so that's that's the game plan. I want to get a big build up here before I start running the quarry, even though it's like it's actually really efficient in the fact that it won't take very much to run these quarries. I just want to get them up and running. That's all. So um, 
yeah, I think I might actually go ahead and I'm going to get the stuff that I need to set up this quarry um, and I'll be back. All right, guys, I am back. Um, so unfortunately, we can kind of have to do the old school way of storing items and chests. I don't really have a better way to store the items yet. I've been looking into it and I just really can't find anything that I like. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start laying out where I want to put my quarry at. I, I want to kind of give myself some room in between the areas. So probably like... Maybe like right there, I think. Yeah, that should be enough room. <clears throat> okay, so let's go ahead and we need to make one more uh, marker here. Let's throw a torch. Um, so my game plan is to get this set up and then before I run it, I want to go back to my base and search like cobblestone. You know, I want to get everything set up to be okay first. So let's go there. <clears throat> I love landmarks, or these markers, or whatever, the landmarks, yeah. These things are amazing, by the way. Um, well, let's go do the other side. On the bright side, we're going to get some crystals. <laughs> so, we might even get some wood. I don't know, I think Hypno chopped it all down already, though. <clears throat> there we go. So, all we got to do is come back here and connect this. This is, this is pretty simple stuff here. Nothing... Crap. Nothing too fancy. There we go. So there's our quarry selection, 64 by 64. Uh, I did not want to do that. I forgot that mycelium spreads. Like I said, I, I would really love to move to an advanced quarry eventually because these quarries are pretty pretty slow. So um, get rid of all this really quickly. I just want to have some room to work here. Okay. So first things first, let's put the quarry down. Go there. Okay. Then we want to be able to give the quarry power. So we're gonna need this, this, this. Um, I had to break these for a second. It's a good thing these things don't move. Um, did I not bring a pickaxe? I did not bring a pickaxe with me. Okay, it's fine. I'll just make a uh, a wood one. Hopefully, we can use a wood one. That would be second time ever crafting one of those. Okay, I can't. I guess I could break that. It'll be okay. It's just gonna take a minute. Slow. <laughs> oh my god, this is so funny. I don't think we're gonna get it. Oh, we did get it back. Wow. I really didn't think we were going to. There we go. So we're up to, what, 24 buckets? Or 48 buckets. I don't remember. Uh, let's check and see how we're doing up here. Oh, these are doing spectacular. Awesome. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and craft our stupid chests because I have to. Uh, I cannot wait till we go to ME. Once we go to ME, then we can just start literally importing everything into that system. But in the meantime, we have to do it like this, and this is the most, uh It's like, I, I'm like living in a cave world right now, like, I'm like a caveman. Living in the, like, ne Neanderthal area of life. That should, oh crap, that should be good. Um, I cannot place down anything today. There, <laughs> oh my god, I moved too fast, man. Uh, that's gonna kill my OCD. I'll just make a couple more. There we go. That should be good. And then we're gonna need this stuff. Come out, and then we're gonna have a diamond pipe. And we'll just do same thing we did for the other quarry. I can't wait till we can do that 256 by 256 quarry. Uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, the quarries plus mod uh, allows you to do bigger size quarries and I cannot wait. <clears throat> there we go. And then let's throw our void pipes on these suckers. We're gonna probably need about three of them because of how much different pieces of cobblestone there are. This is pretty much good to go. Um, just gotta throw these on here. And give that fuel, and we'll be good. Just like, I don't want to avoid, let me, uh, I don't want to avoid that. 
Not that it will, but there we go. Um, okay, so I'm going to get set up and grab all the blocks I possibly can for voiding, and I'll be right back. Okay, so the main reason why I wanted to void so much stuff off is because <clears throat> there's 16 different pieces of cobblestone. That's not cool. <laughs> That's very uncool. Uh, okay, so let's do green first. Yeah, I had to uh, I had to search every single chest I had. I found all of them. Um, I counted up here. There were 16 of them. Dude, not cool, Minecraft. Not cool, buddy. That looks the same to me. Is that the same? No. And see, they all look very, very similar, which is not really my friend. There we go. That one, what is that? Is that like a opal? Gotcha. Go in the right spot. There we go. Is that the same? See? See why I made such a big deal about wanting to do this? Because we filled up two rows in yellow. <laughs> too strong. Too strong, guys. Uh, throw all these down the ground. They'll all get voided. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to throw um, some liquid ducks down. <clears throat> Excuse me. I just had breakfast and I had bacon. And my throat's like Larginson's. All right. So let's... Um, I've lost my power helmet. I wonder what I did with that thing. That should be good. And then let's go ahead and fly Zors. Hopefully 17 is enough. Or just, you know, go the wrong way immediately. I don't know, man. It's going to be close. I think we'll have enough, though. Talk about cutting it close. Holy crap. Uh, okay, so then we need to install a servo. And that. And these guys should be filling up. Good to go. Now, okay, so that's storing MJ. I don't know how much these are producing. So this should be getting full power, uh, if I'm not mistaken. It's going pretty quickly, though. Just kind of watching. Let's see, is it draining this at all? Ballin'! We're still gaining biofuel. <laughs> That's awesome! And then these things have completely filled up. Yeah. <clears throat> Do you get the items? I don't think you get those items. I think it just deletes those items. Um, so it looks like it's outputting anywhere from 10 to 40 MJ per tick. Uh, so I'm pretty sure this guy is going to have more than enough power to run at full speed. Yeah, I mean, look how fast it just cleared that area out. So I think we'll be good to go. Okay, so I basically got sick of waiting on the regular quarry. I think I'm going to make the advanced quarry. I know Jassassin has these lasers and I need to borrow them. I don't think he's going to mind. I'm not here to, like, use his stuff or anything. I really just want to uh, make this guy and I'll be out of here. Um, so we need two of these and two of these. So I'm kind of curious. Does he not have them turned? Actually, you know what? I bet I have to hit the button. I wonder how fast it goes. So I get steady, holding steady. Uh, just asking. Um, if if like if there's a problem with me using this, I'll like give you something. I don't think you're gonna mind, but. Uh, I just wanted to borrow them for a minute so I can make my stuff so I can make an advanced quarry because I'm sick of waiting on that slow thing. Hey right, guys, I am back. I uh, I have, think I have everything I need. I actually need to craft um, a chest. I don't. I guess I could just use this as a crafting square. Um, actually, oh, I just gave him some wood. <laughs> my bad. There we go. <clears throat> Pretty sure I only needed eight of them. Let's come over here. So this is an assembly table. Uh, so we need our quarry. We need this. We need this. And we need this. And we need this. So we'll go ahead and start the advanced quarry. It looks like it's actually going to take a while. Ooh, blue. 
Oh, that's going to take a while. Holy crap. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'll be back in a second. Okay, I am back in my base. Um, I'm going to get some food first. Let's do that. Um, okay, that did a little bit of food. I just need a little bit of food. Do I not have any apples? I had the zillion apples like a day ago. There we go. That should do it. Now... Um, actually, you know what? I probably have what I need over here. I don't have a way to enchant this yet, but you can enchant these. Uh, and that's the one thing I don't have yet. Um, otherwise, I would use it clearly. But uh, it looks like we need to head back really quickly. I gotta grab some more lapis. Um, I don't think I will need the uh, markers plus because I have, um, I'm only using the 64 by 64 still. I, I, from what I hear, this thing is a lot faster than a regular quarry, and that's what we're going for, so. Uh, let's head back. Okay, so yeah, I want to see what kind of speed it runs, and then we'll go from there. Um, here we go. But uh, yeah, I'm actually I'm pretty excited to see how this thing does. So because I was I, I watched a couple tutorials on it, and from the tutorials, it looks pretty neat. Um, you can add enchantments to it. You can put fortune on it. Um, all kinds of cool stuff. So there we go. How am I gonna? There we go. <laughs> Let's see how fast it goes. Okay, so are these things holding up? It's holding energy. How's this doing? Still gaining. So right now it's just clearing the stuff. Oh, it may it's a smaller one. Oh, okay. So it's not gonna get rid of the top one. But holy poopy, it's going fast. Look at that thing. Zoom zoom zoom. World's fastest quarry? I think so. So this thing is supposed to be, like, lightning fast from what I hear. And I don't know what it's doing. Where's it at? Okay, it's over here. Eh. Yeah, that's... That's sort of faster. I think it needs efficiency. To make it go, like... No, that's pretty quick. Hmm. I don't. I can't tell if that's faster or not. To be honest with you, I'm sure it is in a little ways. Um, uh, there is no way to like really click on it. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess it's an upgrade. It seems like it's going faster at least. It could just be me being excited. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Now that I look at it, it does seem like it's going a little bit faster. Hmm. All right. Well. Uh, eventually I would like to make this guy right here the enchant mover um, this is a way to uh, put enchantments on this guy uh, what it'll do is if you can put fortune um, all of that good stuff on there and uh, it'll be awesome so uh, I'm gonna let this run for a little while all right guys I am back I come over here to this is this the enchant table yeah uh, I need to find a crafting square really quickly there's never any crafting squares around here. Actually, I think there's one right here. Aha! Alright, so I'm going to make a couple diamond picks here. We'll start off with two and go from there. I'm going to do a level 30 on these. Hopefully it doesn't take very long to get to level 30. I want to get these set up in my base. Um, I just got to find them first. I haven't been able to find any of these anywhere. <clears throat> so what we're going to do is we're going to enchant a pickaxe and hopefully get fortune on it. But knowing my luck, I'll probably get like unbreaking. Uh, we just have to wait to get to level 30. Oh, I forgot that they had that other enchantment area over there too. I might have been able to get to level 30 faster if I went over there. This is pretty quick though to get to level 30. I have to say like uh, stand here for like two seconds and you're at level 30. <laughs> so... Um, Purple potions. You can't right click on them. Okay. Uh, we're almost there. Why you go so slow for? I want to go faster. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I, I'm having a lot of fun 
um, just kind of figuring out what these things, the, all these new things do, because, you know, when you play FEB, you're kind of set in your ways as to what you're doing, and uh, learning new stuff is a lot of fun, so I gotta say, pretty happy about that. There we go. I'll take it. There we go. All right, so this thing that I have in my inventory is a um, enchant mover. So we'll put that down. We'll put our quarry plus over here and we'll put that pickaxe we just got right there. And we will add fortune to efficiency and unbreaking. So we're gonna add all of that and we get to keep that on there. So actually it took it off there, okay, cool. Um, I don't really wanna wait there for another fortune. So it's all good though. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm actually gonna re, re replace the, the thing down now that it's got a fetch. Oh, I can't talk. I'm going to replace it down now that it's got enchantments on it. All right, well, here goes nothing. Um, if it doesn't go any faster now, then I know for a fact that it needs more power. Um, we'll see. I'm assuming it probably will need more power. Um, oh, you know what I forgot? I hope my... Uh, that could be bad. I'm sure they disappeared by now. Yep, and they're gone. All right, I got to get my markers back. I completely forgot about those things. Let me see if there's any of them over here. No markers. Okay. Oh, well, we have everything we need to make them, so it's all good. I didn't even think about that, to be honest with you. Silly Jevin not doing what he's supposed to be doing. It's my bad, guys. So this quarry has uh, Fortune 2 on it. Um, uh, we can easily change that to Fortune 3, but I'm just so anxious that I could care less if it's Fortune 2 or Fortune 3. You want to know why? Because a regular Cory doesn't have any fortune on it, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> so, um, okay. Let's go. Here. And then let's see if we can get it in the right spot. There we go. And it should be deleting those other ones. Let's see. I don't quite understand what the top of this means. Um, because I, I've, we watched it change before. Okay, so it's changing green. All right, so that means that it's placing those things down, I'm assuming. Because it was blue when it was breaking. It goes so fast. Oh my god. How much power has he got stored? Oh wow, he's got a lot of power stored. It's full. Okay, so now it should be done in just a second. Okay, so now it's good to start mining. Holy shit. I'm trying not to cuss, guys. Uh, GG? Yeah, GG. I think so. GG. <laughs> okay, now my only concern is, is it using more power? Oh, that is redact- that- that- I'm- I'm cons- I'm pulling this- this is- it's redonkulous. It's redonkulous. So, it's used about 3k power. Is it- actually we're still holding strong up here but how are these guys doing okay i don't even think it's gonna matter by the time this thing finishes it'll be like oh you need more power okay this is ridiculous look at that thing i could watch this all day all day every day I have a new best friend, guys, and his name is Corey's Plus. <laughs> Holy crap. Look at that thing. Uh, oh, I, I don't know what to say. Like, it's beautiful. I'm speechless, man. Uh, I think it... The only thing is, like I said, I think it is using more power, but... Eh, I wonder what will happen if it... If it, the buildup dies down, I guess it would start taking from these guys more. If anything, let's we'll put one more on there. Oh my goodness, though. All right, so I have to stop staring at this and end the video. <laughs> I can't help myself. Um, so, oh, why do we have uh, XP over here for? Her? I'll take the XPs. Thank you. That was weird. I wonder what that came from. Anyways, guys, I hope that you enjoyed today's video. When we come back next time shit's gonna get real because i plan on running this multiple times uh between now and the next video which means awesome stuff also i think we might be ditching the power armor i don't know yet i kind of want to try out the quantum 
Um, from what I hear, Quantum now has a jetpack, and that would be pretty neat to have. Um, yeah, so it has a jetpack there. It shouldn't be too hard to craft, so... I don't know. We'll see what happens. But, um, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a rating. I hope that you guys uh, have a great day. This is iJevin. Peace out.